Why is Bitcoin struggling to break past the $65,000 mark? Let's dive into the world of Bitcoin ETFs and their impact on the cryptocurrency's price. Bitcoin ETFs have been a game changer since their approval in January, providing institutional investors with a new way to buy BTC on stock exchanges. This development bolstered the rally to an all-time high of around $73,000 in Q1. However, as of late, Bitcoin ETFs have seen significant outflows contributing to the most cryptocurrency struggles. As outflows surge, Bitcoin tends to plunge or consolidate, as evidenced by the dismal level for the performance of, of the stock Bitcoin ETF in April and May. Um, on June 18th, Bitcoin price hovered at 64,945 during U.S. trading hours, while data from SoSo Value highlighted a $152 million net ETF outflow. This persistent outflow since last week has caused the cumulative total net inflow to drop to $14.81 billion. The downturn in Bitcoin price may continue if the sentiment fails to recover. Similarly, data by Cohen Glass reveals the Bitcoin futures market open interest falling to $36.4 billion, an all-time high of $37 billion. Falling OI often hints at a continued downtrend with the relative strength index dropping in the neutral area to 39 Bitcoin scream sell. If this trend sustains, the decline will intensify to the next support at $64,000. Therefore, traders can keep in mind the level of $64,000 as the first support while staying open to the possibility of BTC diving to $62,500 and even seeking support for its $60,000. Uh, and now for a joke, why don't Bitcoin miners tell secrets? Because they might hash it out. With that said, thanks for watching. Until next time.